I have a prediction that we're going to have, we already have a multitude of women suffering from mental illnesses of anxiety and yeah. you know, depression and withdrawals, whatever the fuck it is. Nearly every woman I personally know is on psychiatric medication. Jeez. Oh, that's crazy. Wow. I predict, and I said this on another episode, but I'm going to say it one more time. In the next 20 to 30 years, right, These when these Gen Zers are older and past the wall, right, because they're really the ones that are like on the... Four yeah. The like wall, the man. The wall. I remember what it was like to not have social media and growing up on iPads. But these Gen Zers born in the late 90s and early 2000s, dude, they, them especially. That's me. The next 30 to 40 years, you're going to see a mass spike in mental uh, mental uh, medication prescriptions. Like, because it used to be, right? Look at Britney Spears right now, right? I, I, I mean, do you think that or do you think... Since everyone's going through just all this rough stuff, that they'll just that'll just be the norm. You think it'll just become like a norm? Like it's gonna be the norm for a woman to be on OnlyFans or have just like that multiple yeah, like sexualize yourself some way to multiple guys on the internet, and then for guys, it's it's just one well, just have to accept that. That's just how it is. I think that honestly is what's becoming the norm now. With a lot of guys becoming more passive and a lot of guys really don't know what they want, they'll just accept her for her past. That's becoming very common now. A lot of guys are accepting the woman for her past and being like, well, that's just how she was. She's a, she's a different person now. We're going to make this work out. But they don't fully realize the past is a past for a reason. And that sounds really cliche to say, but things from your past stick with you. You are who you are because of your past. So yeah, I can say people can change and be better in the future, but still, my question to the guys would be, why would you want to be with somebody who has that past that might become a problem in the future when you can be with somebody who doesn't have that past? So it's not even a problem you have to worry about for the future. And the one thing about it is as a guy, as you keep increasing your status, you don't have to deal with that, that sort of stuff. You don't have to deal with so many women who have a past. And most of these guys who are the Chads and Tyrones, who are the top 1%, they're not going to want to. They won't take these girls seriously for the long term. They won't. They'll just want to have a fun night and then keep it moving, which adds even more to her past. But the guys out there who really don't know what it is they're looking for, don't really have that much of a backbone to respond. They'll just, they'll just accept it for how it is. They'll be like, yep. This is the type of woman I want. I feel like we can make it work out. They'll make up some sort of story in their head and they'll rock with it. Then 10 years later, they get divorced. That's the biggest thing that I'm trying to avoid, man. I don't want to be in no type of a divorce and whatnot. It's absolutely insane. You think it'll be the norm? People are only growing greedier. Yeah. And a lot of people are getting mental problems more, so they'll watch the stuff more. Absolutely that too. The more things that are going wrong in somebody's life, the more likely they are to keep on pursuing things that are going to make things worse. Whether that be through cigarettes, alcohol, pornography or any kind of other drug or addiction out there man which means more people with the past and bad future it's dude it's a, it's a loop man and it's very hard to break through man it's very hard and yeah don't forget love blinds people that too love is definitely a blinding factor man when somebody feels like they're in love it's much easier for them to just overlook all the bad stuff it, it, dude it's so rough man it's so brutal this is why i literally like i watch these types of things all the time man because it's it's so informative